What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. How you guys feeling, man? I'm good. I'm here. We got another unboxing right here. But before we get into that, I just want to shout out everybody that's been subscribing to the channel. It really means a lot, guys. Like, we're this close to 900. I'll put my counter up here. This close. We're about to hit 900 and the goal is still 1K. So if this is your first time watching my channel, just a quick heads up of what you're gonna get into. What I do, I do sneaker unboxings, I do a lot of Kyrie videos, like ESV videos, and like sneakers that I like. I also talk about anime pickups, my t-shirts, hoodies, jackets. I'm a big fan of anime. We also have sneaker discussions, even though I haven't had one in a while, they're coming back shortly. Believe me, they're coming back shortly. And sneaker rotation. So if you're a fan of any of the things I mentioned just now, Hit that button down below, subscribe. I'll give you a couple seconds. Cool. All right, and all I ask that you guys do is just drop a like on this video for me and let's get into it. Oh, here we are. So what we have here is the Kyrie Low 4 Keep Soup Fresh Laser Blue. So the thing about this one, I never had a pair of Kyrie 4 Lows. I was looking for the right color and they came out the original Keep Soup Fresh Lows, but I didn't really like the color blocking on that specifically for me. So I waited for these. Um, so first things first, before we get into this, I'm gonna show you the box. So similar to like a Kyrie 7 box, which is black and red, the Kyrie Low box is white and red. And the cool thing I love the most about these Kyrie boxes is like, when you open up the box, it's kind of like entering the mind of Kyrie Irving. You see all these prints and graphics. It's really, really dope. I hope this carries on to the Kyrie 8 in some way. So when we fill this paper back, we're gonna have them right here. And here we go. The Kyrie Low 4 Keep Soup Fresh Laser Blue. These look way, way better than the original pair that released a couple months ago. And I'm really happy that I was able to grab this pair. Let me just grab the other one real quick to show you guys. Ooh, here they go, such beauties. Let me set this up and let's dive into the release. First things first, I wanna talk about the release of this shoe. When is it coming out in the US? I don't know. Uh, this was supposed to drop in August, I believe, towards the end of August, when it's September now, I haven't seen anything on Nike.com, I haven't seen anything on Foot Locker. So I was just like, you know what? I'ma just pull the trigger on the overseas site. I'ma link the site down below. I believe it was called size.co.uk. Official site, I checked their Instagram to make sure everything was good. They're official. So when you, if you're gonna go for these shoes on that on any overseas website, all the sizes are, are listed in UK sizes. So mind, be mindful before you pull the trigger and buy that shoe because you're thinking it's in US sizes because of course they're used to shopping in the US, but it's UK sizes, so I have to grab the UK size 10 and a half, which is a men's US 11 and a half. So be very careful before you pull that, but before you press that confirm button to pay for these. Number two, since we're talking about sizing, I just go over it. Like when it comes to all my Kyries, I go up a half size. I usually wear a size 11. These, I grab these guys in an 11 and a half as all my other Kyries. And they fit really good. They fit perfect, just the way I like to fit. Not too snug, not moving around, just the right fit for me. So I tell anybody, if you have a wide foot like I do, go up half a size. If you have a narrow foot, you probably play it true to size. But me personally, I have a wider foot. I know I got a wide foot, so get all that true to size stuff let me get the half size up and they always fit just right so where did keep soup fresh come from the hashtag for this shoe what you're gonna see on the right tongue right here so quick story if you didn't know um sue bird plays for the seattle storm if you don't know who sue bird is please do your youtubes do your googles right after you watch this video though go check it out you'll know exactly who she is amazing WNBA player so Kyrie linked up with her in the 2016, oh, uh, not All-Star, 2016 Rio Olympics, I believe. Yeah, it was the Rio Olympics, it's definitely Rio. They both won gold medal for the country and him and her developed a really good relationship. And since then, they had like a great partnership and he's just been giving her the range to do whatever she wants with the Kyries. He has some amazing Kyrie PEs and she eventually got her first pair like a first collaboration, if you will, between the two players. When 20, I believe it was 2018 or 2019, I think it was 2019 with the Kyrie 5 Keep Soup Fresh. And I do want that pair. I don't think it released in the big quantities because it's really hard for me to find it my size right now. And then they came back in 2021 this year with the Keep Soup Fresh, the green pair. Now they have the alternate pair, which when I finally get a US release date, I'll definitely update you guys on my Instagram if I can. So stay tuned for that. And 
Yeah, you're working on a key soup brush, Kyrie 8. I have some images right here from K11 Kicks on Instagram. He posted these, so I don't know. It's still hard for me to say about the Kyrie 8, but there's the information right there. So, you know what I mean? Or it might be over here, wherever, but uh, yeah. Leave the Kyrie 8 for another video. Now that we got all that out the way, let's get into breaking down this shoe. So first things first, you wanna have this beautiful outsole. And if you guys have any Kyrie 7s, then you should recognize this outsole because this is the exact same outsole that he uses on the Kyrie 7. I'm a big fan of the outsole and I'm a big fan of the Kyrie 7s. To be honest, I think that's my favorite Kyrie model so far. It's an amazing shoe. And definitely, since it's the same outsole, you're still gonna have the whole Kobe cord at the back of it. His legacy is gonna live on forever. Amazing, beautiful outsole, love it. Working your way up, you're gonna hit the midsole. And the midsole on the Kyrie 7 is five long, but on this one, they have it marked right here. It's a full length Cushlon. So, of course, you think Cushlon, me personally, when I think about Cushlon and Kyrie, I'm thinking back to the Kyrie 4. That Cushlon's soft, it's plush, it felt really good. And you probably, right now, you probably think about the KD 14. That's Cushlon as well. But this one isn't as plush, it's a bit more firm. So you're not gonna get that same bounce from the, like the Kyrie 4 or the KD14 with these guys. A lot, it's a bit more firmer, and I guess you have to break them in, but just a heads up on that, it is a full length Kushlon, and they do have an air zoom unit in the forefoot, nothing in the heel. Now this is where my favorite part comes in, the upper. So on the upper, you're gonna have this ripstop and this textile, and it's all in these different shades of blue. And I know, I know, if you guys watch the channel, you know I'm not the biggest fan of blue shoes. I get it, I get it. But these are beautiful, like, what you want me to do? Like, not have a pair, and for me to be a Kyrie collector and not have a pair of Keep Soup Fresh Kyries, it's kinda, it's kinda blasphemous. I mean, I didn't get the first one, I get it, I, I didn't like the color. Kyrie 5 is hard for me to get right now, but these, for retail, yeah, I'll take those. So on the upper ear, on the upper by the toe box, you're gonna have this nice shade of royal blue. Then <clears throat> for your lockdown support on the fingers right here, um, it's a different shade of blue just for that lockdown. Blends in really nice. Then you have these really nice pink laces wrapping up the top. And on the right foot up there, you're gonna see hashtag keep suit fresh. And on the left foot, you're gonna see the Kyrie Urban logo right there. Pretty clean. Then towards the back, you're gonna have another shade of light blue with like the slime green colorway from like the outsole peeking through. And you're gonna have on the outer swoosh, this university gold, and on the inner swoosh, this color, this same green from the outsole. Now for the back, you definitely do have a heel cup right here. And in the back by the um, midsole, you have Hungry, Humble, Kyrie's mantra right there. And you have a basketball with the moon. And on the right, yeah, both of them have the moon on the back right there. Pretty clean. And it even has a little bit more, where you go to the inner liner and behind the tongue, you have like a heat map right here, similar to what you will find in the Kyrie 7 Weathermans. Really heat mapping of the foot, really dope. And on the inner, and on the insole, it's gonna be like that soft pink with the Kyrie Irvin. Kyrie Low 4. And that's pretty much it for these guys. Like these ones are fire. I wish that we had a US release date because I know I know I'm freaking out about these. I'm geeking. I'm not even a fan of blue shoes. I know how you guys are gonna go crazy for these. And trust me, whew, they are beauty. A lot better than the originals, in my opinion. Still, the originals, like I said, a lot of people assumed I was gonna get those. I even had some people hit me up on my IG, like, hey, um, do you get the Kyrie Low 4? It keeps them fresh. And I was just like, nah. Even though Kyrie's my guy and I buy a lot of Kyrie's, like you guys do know. I'm very picky on the calories that I purchase. So with that being said, I just don't go for every and anything. Keep soup fresh. What do you guys think? Y'all feeling them? Y'all want them? Y'all like them? Y'all don't like them? What don't you like about them? Would you get them? Let me know down below. And as always, peace, love, and positivity. The on feet is coming up next, so stay tuned for that. Check out how these bad boys look on feet. And we got more Kyrie stuff coming. I have a, another pair of Kyrie 7s that I got the other day that I have to do a review on. It's one of the old, it's an older pair, 
not that old I just didn't get a chance to do the review for it but that's coming as well and some other good stuff is coming so appreciate you guys for tuning in appreciate you guys for dropping a like appreciate you guys for subscribing keep riding road to 1k let's go all be coming up next I'll see you guys in the next video with that I'm out <laughs>